What's up guys, how you doing? This is Kunal. This is our third tutorial on Google Charts. And in last tutorial, we made column chart. But we forgot to do, uh, forgot about the response nature of the column chart. So let's check our column chart is responsive or not. So, okay, after I change the size of window, browser window, you can see it's not responsive. I can see my complete co uh, column chart. So, today we are going to make it responsive so and we don't even have to write that much of code so let's uh, this is my uh, earlier the earlier tutorial code code of a column chart and you can see uh, just the little bit changes i have done is that i have just included cdn uh, cdn script of a uh, jquery so that's it to make it responsive we just gonna need a jquery very fine and uh, we have to add an event uh, window uh, window resize uh, resize jQuery event so let's add it window dot resize all right function and this event as soon as the window resize we want our this chart due to be responsive the, uh, due with uh, id chart due to be the responsive because that's the due where our uh, google prints out our column chart so but this column chart is printed by the function uh, written in a script named draw basic so actually so what we have to do is we have to click this function within our jQuery resize event that's it and hence our column uh, column chart response nature is completely ready let's check hit the refresh and let's see if response or not and I don't have internet if yeah so i just connect i uh, just reconnected to my wi-fi and let's hit refresh and let's see more. let's see is our chart is response or not okay so guys we have made our google chart responsive well uh, i have been uh, seeing this how to make google chart responsive uh, question on google uh, lots of time and uh, a few of my friends were also asking so i thought I should make another video on that so thank you guys for watching this video and i will be coming out soon with more videos on google apis that how we can make our google map and lots of google stuff so for that just you need to do is subscribe and hit the like button if you like this video and don't forget to write the comment if you need something from me or any any more video which you would like to suggest uh, suggest me on column chart or any google api just all you have to do is write the comment uh, write the comment and i will make a video on that so thank you guys for watching my video